ideas of why maybe they set goals for themselves or uh, potentially why you might want to set a goal? Anything? Any ideas? To become healthier and to lose weight. That's one of my goals. Yeah, absolutely. So having, um, having goals themselves keep you kind of focused on a specific aspect, right? Um, for me, um, this is kind of one of the points I had is that goals keep you focused. For you, um, what your goals keep you focused on is losing weight, right? And being healthy. Um, for sure. Absolutely. Good example. Um, what about any other things? Any other reasons why we might keep goals for ourselves? To same thing, same thing what he said, but try to try to find more healthy outfits at grocery stores. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So uh, another thing that goals help you do is they help focus your actions and they kind of focus your attention on what really matters, right? So for you, uh, one of the big things that you're trying to do is focus your attention on um, those little actions, right? That's one of your goals is to focus on the actions of going to a grocery store and getting those things. So um, kind of kind of similar, but yeah, for sure, for sure. Good ideas. Um, another thing that I always like to have goals for to lean on to is that they help with both long-term and short-term success. When we're moving through our lives, there's so many different things that clutter our day-to-day -day activities um, and kind of our motivation to get things done, uh, whether it's health-related or not. So having these goals keep you both working on something short-term but also in the long term, right? So um, some of those long term goals might be just generally being healthier, right? Uh, in the short term, there's a lot of other goals, uh, smaller goals, I should say, that we can do to help that long term goal in the future. So, absolutely good. Um, keeps, you, keeps you accountable for yourself. Yeah, accountability, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. Because at the end of the day, you think about um, setting these health goals for yourself. Who really cares about those goals other than you? In the grand scheme of things, you know, um, there's not many others that want us to be healthy or really, really care for us to be healthy. So having that accountability of the goal, um, even if it's something small, really, really helps to keep it, um, keep it in your life, right? So for sure. Um, one of the last things that I think goals are super, super helpful for is that they remind you of where you started. How many times when we first uh, maybe started Special Olympics, uh, maybe we started a workout program or started trying to eat healthier, um, we start from kind of that first ground zero, of maybe not knowing what to do at all. From there, you learn a lot of different things. Maybe you learn how to be a better teammate. Uh, maybe you learn how to make some healthier choices at the grocery store. But in that time, you kind of forget how much progress you've truly made for yourself. Because of this, we can often get uh, undetermined, uh, excuse me, um, we don't appreciate how far we've come, right? So if we don't look back at where we started as that person who couldn't make very independent decisions for themselves, um, didn't really know where to start, but now you're somebody who can uh, make goals all the time for yourself and really, really know how to improve your health and wellness. Um, it just keeps you even more motivated to keep up with those short and long-term goals. So yeah, really good ideas, guys. Really good ideas. Does anyone have any questions on just kind of um, some of the purpose we might set goals for ourselves? And if not, that's totally okay. Um, again, feel free to, to if you do. Yeah, go ahead. To get in shape, to get in shape for a sports, I mean, person. One more time, please. To get in shape, to get in shape for sports, um, in person. Oh, to get safe for doing sports again in person. Yeah. Um. So, are you uh in regards to like uh COVID or just like being um physically physically fit to do sports? Um, uh, both. Yeah. So absolutely. So again kind of something you're mentioning is that they keep you 
um, focused on your specific activities. So for you, uh, what goals you might set for yourself are something that help you to get back to sports safely. So um, consistently uh, getting out and practicing your sport before you go and do so. Um, just maybe even getting comfortable with that idea of being around people again. Um, a lot of your goals might have to do with that and be focused around that. So absolutely. I'm out of it, I'm out of it.